Hello everyone, today I want to show you how to simplify this nice algebraic expression without using the calculator. So if we have 9 to the power of 5 divided by 9 to the power of 5 minus 1. So here we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form. Uh, so I hope so you like this method, but if you have any other method in your mind, so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section. So uh, the very first step we are going to do is here first we need to find the value of this 9 to the power of 5 uh, so that now here uh, we will do all of the focus on 9 to the power of 5. So first we find the value of 9 to the power of 5. So for this uh, here uh, we already know about that uh, how to find the value of 9 to the power of 5 or 9 to the power of 5 means that now we need to multiply this 9 with 5 times in this way we multiply 9 by 9 by 9 and 9 with 9 so 9 to the power of 5 means that we multiply 9 with 5 times in this way and now here you see that this is 9 times of 9 becomes 81 multiplied by again uh, this 9 times of 9 is also equals to 81 and this will be comes here 9 only and now here in the next step uh, first we need to multiply this 81 with 81 and 9 and after that we easily get the value of 9 to the power of 5 uh, so far this so now here first we need to multiply 81 with this 9 and we write this 81 as it is so uh, here we uh, directly multiply these terms and here you have this is 9 times of 1 becomes here 9 and 9 8 is a 72 so this will be written as 729 and now here in the next step uh, we again multiply this 81 with the 729 so that first we rewrite these terms as first we can write 729 and now we break this 81 as in this form we write 81 as 80 plus 1 uh, and now here we need to multiply the 729 on both of these values so it will be written as 729 multiplied by 80 plus 729 multiplied by 1 so in the next step uh, you see here uh, we need to multiply these two numbers so here I can give you a nice method in which you multiply the bigger numbers directly in your mind uh, without using the calculator or any gadgets so that here uh, first we consider this is our one digit number and this is our two digit numbers when you multiply zero with this number you get zero because we know that uh, when we multiply zero with any other number it is always gives us the answer is zero so 0 times of this number becomes 0 and 8 times of this number is, is equals to 8 9 are 72 we write uh, 2 and carry 7 here and 8 2 are 16 16 plus 7 becomes 23 uh, we write uh, we write 3 and carry 2 and we have 8 7 are 56 56 plus 2 becomes here 58 so it means that when we multiply 729 with 80 you get here this number and 729 times of 1 is equals to 729 so here in the next step uh, we need uh, to sum up these two values and here we can add these two values directly you see here uh, we have this is 0 plus 9 equals to 9 2 plus 2 becomes 4 and 3 plus 7 becomes 10 we write 0 and carry 1 and this 8 plus 1 becomes 9 and this is our 5 so it means that the value of 9 to the power of 5 is equals to 59,041 and now here we move backward and we put this value of 9 to the power of 5 into the given algebraic expression so this is our given question statement so that we can put the value of 9 to the power of 5 on these two places and we write here the remaining term as it is uh, and now here our above expression is implies that this is 9 to the power of 5 divided by 9 to the power of 5 minus 1 is equals to here we put the value of 9 to the power of 5 here and it will be written as 59,049 and it is divided by 
59,049 and minus 1. So this is our minus 1. And now here uh, in the next step, we first subtract these two values. Uh, so when you subtract this value by this, you will uh, write it as 59,049 and it is divided by this will be written as 59048 okay so uh, here in the next step uh, we write our answer into the simplified form so that now we can write 59049 as 59048 and plus 1 and it is divided by this is 59048 okay uh, so so that in the next step here we need to break this fraction and uh, when we break this fraction so it will be written as uh, 59,048 divided by 59,048 and plus we write this term as a 1 divided by 59,048. So you see here this term is cancelled out by this term and we get here 1 only and plus here you have this is 1 is divided by 59,048. So in the left hand side we have this is 9 to the power of 5 divided by 9 to the power of 5 minus 1. So here when we combine uh, these three terms so we write these three terms into the mixed fraction form. Uh, so that the mixed fraction form of these terms uh, could be written as uh, 1 whole 1 divided by uh, 59,048. So uh, this is the our final value of 9 to the power of 5 divided by 9 to the power of 5 minus 1. Uh, this is the final answer of this problem. And thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.